اولم یورو علامہ خلق اللہ منشین یا تفیع ضلع انل جمین و شمائل سجد اللہ وہم داخرون وللہ یسجد و ماف السماوات و ماف الرض ابن دابطن و الملائے کتو و ہم لا یستک پھر ہوں دی ٹرانسلیشن از ہیو دے ناٹ آبزرو بوئنگ ان ہیومیلٹی بفور اللہ دیٹ دی شیڈوز آف ایوری تھنگ which Allah has created shift from the right and from the left and they are being humbled and whatever is in the heavens and whatever cre- creature is in the earth submits humbly to Allah and the angels too and they are not proud mm. Could you please kindly explain that w- what is the meaning of that the shadows of everything which Allah has created shifts from the right and from the left and they are being humbled. <coughs> In fact here, the lal are not used to indicate darkness. It only indicates here a person or things which submit to a superior thing. So that is the real meaning here. If you understand the lal to be shade, shadows or darkness, then you will miss the whole meaning. That is why in another verse the same the lal is used in that sense like the lalum bil gudu wa Everyone, everything submits to Allah and the lalum, those who follow them. For instance, Hazrat Muhammad Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam submits to the will of Allah. And who were the Zilal, the Sahaba, the companions of the Holy Prophet? They all submitted to the will of Allah behind him. So he was the Imam and the rest were shadows. So it is only in that sense that Zilal is used here, not in the sense of darkness. Darkness has nothing to do with God and godly people. It's a result of a separation of light of Allah and people who stand behind that curtain which interrupts the light of Allah, they are in the darkness. Their zilal is different. But here it is the zilal of those who follow a spiritual leader. Right? And right and left means the entire world belongs to Allah and to His people who follow Him. It's not a question of right or left in other sense. East belongs to them and the West belongs to them. And the shadows, that is those who follow Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, wherever they go, they bow to him. Right? Yes. 